previously on the Inges channel. But the long-term game plan obviously is to find more good units like this to pop up, buy enough houses that will kind of generate cash per month and so we can basically retire. So we're kind of on the lookout for more properties like this that kind of sell below market value because they need a little bit of work. That's how you find the good deals and so that's what we're doing. I feel like buying houses is gonna be the exit strategy to being financially free. Now obviously buying houses takes a lot of money up front so I have ground for like five years just trying to make as much money as possible so we could buy these kind of deals because it's a lot of upfront money that you have to make by working hard um, and then you put that money into houses and those will pay you just a little bit per month but if you do that enough times that little bit becomes a lot more you can't jump into deals if they're not a great deal so that's the game plan it just takes a lot of work a lot of patience a lot of patience there's nothing on the market right now so <laughs> so we're really trying to get something that pops up Well, that is a wrap on our new investment property. It's a one bed, one bath, duplex. Both sides are just mirrored, so you guys can see over here. One bedroom here, and then the bathroom in here. We're basically just coming over here to make the small repairs and whatnot. Since we just got into this property, this side was vacant. Um, and so I don't know how long it had been vacant before, but probably at least you know several, several months. So we had a few things to fix up, tightening light switches, tightening cabinets, my bad, I turned it off. Um, just little things like that. And this is the exterior of the unit. You guys can see there's two units here. It's a corner lot and it's got lots of parking. You guys can see the garage structure maybe way over there. Uh, so that'll eventually be another house. So yeah, it's, it's, I'm just really excited. I think it's gonna be an awesome, awesome property all said and done but i'm excited to get this thing operational property manager is already managing a thing we're getting it marketed this week and getting this unit filled so yeah i'm super excited i think it's gonna be a great property in the long run so this side is now officially ready to rent and we just got the flooring installed which looks really nice there were a couple repairs we had to do in the laundry room uh had a little bit of water damage from the previous uh, tenant or whatever so we had to you know get take the flooring out repair the stuff and then refloor it but it needed new flooring anyway so that's cool um kitchen laundry room over here not a whole lot it's not like super impressive or whatever uh, but it's an exciting time it really is I, it's sometimes when you're doing these deals it took us like two months to actually get into this um, the escrow was just two months and it just took a long time there the seller was not very um, like he accommodating the seller didn't help out very much on a lot of issues that they caused <laughs> then we had to fix um, so it was two months of just trying to get into this place but now that it's ours it's a really exciting time um, but sometimes it's hard you know you lose focus of, of how exciting it is when there's so many hassles you have to overcome to actually get into it but we're the official new owners so it's very exciting um, the backyard now this is a duplex I said duplex I cannot speak tonight um, but there is a, a vacated garage unit back there that actually has the exact exterior as this house uh, very nice stucco very nice roofing um, even the interior of the garage structure, which is, it's a two car garage, but the units are actually separate. So it's actually longer than an actual two car garage. Um, anyway, even all the framing and everything is the same as the house unit. Um, and so that's going to get converted into another unit here in California. They do, do not mind when people convert detached garage structures into ADUs, accessory dwelling units, uh, basically just extra an extra house on the property and you can legally rent that stuff out so we're going to be hiring somebody a contractor to just renovate somebody who specializes doing adus in the area to renovate the garage structure into a livable house basically and start renting that out as well so it's an exciting time this was an awesome property we got it for 250 i think it was that 250 because it was at 260 so. and then we offered 250 because they had a couple of seller or so. buyers back out before us. And so they accepted our 250 offer since 260 was just kind of pushing it for the market, um, for the property and all repairs needing and whatever. So we got 250 all said and done. And for a triplex in California, it's just, yeah, it's, it's a really good property for 250, especially if it's a triplex, like that is insane 
ROI. <laughs> Um, so I'm really excited. Even just the two units, we do have kind of a bum tenant in the other one. And in California, it is hard to kick people out, <laughs> unfortunately. But even with the current tenant and the new one in here at market value, once we get this thing rented out, property managed as well. So that is, you know, this is the last time we have to be here, hopefully. <laughs> and before we just see the residual just checks coming in every month. It, we should still be doing decent profit on it even though we have a tenant who is way below market value and the new tenant that we get at market value we should i mean we should still be profiting at least 600 700 she's like 50 percent below market value right yeah now. dude she is like way below she's been there for 20 years apparently never had her rent increased and so yeah it was late by crazy. two months already yeah even with the 10 percent we could increase it already she's still at like six hundred dollars a month and i mean market value is twelve hundred dollars a month mm -hmm. so that's insane and, and in california you can't raise it more than ten percent each year either so it's going to take a long time to get we'll never get even up close. to market right because market value always goes up every year too so we'll never actually go get up to market value just as it sits so it is what it is but at least we're still making it's still a decent deal <laughs> even with her i it um, so any, but, but anyway, when we get this converted into a triplex, it's going to be an absolute cash cow. I can't wait. It's going to be awesome. It's basically going to pay for our current mortgage of our house, <laughs> like just this property. Um, so anyway, plus, I mean, that's principal pay down as well. The house is getting paid off. Like the property is getting paid off. Um, but we're also cash flowing. That's really important when you're trying to get into real estate and whatnot, you have to make sure it's cash flowing or else the property <laughs> like is just not worth the hassle so you have to have money in your pocket every month even if the house is getting paid off um, so people kind of just justify um, getting into a house because that's what they could afford and uh, if they're renting it out like at least the mortgage is covered almost like we're only losing a little bit per month but you know and they justify it because the house is getting paid down but it just isn't worth it if it's not making you monies every month i don't think it's worth it so um, but this is an awesome property hard find but we we did get it so yeah I'm, I'm happy i'm happy it looks really nice i think this is gonna be a great rental unit all said and done anyway thanks for watching kind of just an update i haven't posted on this channel for like a long time <laughs> it's been a long time um so welcome back to the engine 2.0 glad to have you guys here um i'm definitely going to be doing more stuff on this channel coming soon i've just had so much actually happening that i just have not had enough time literally hours in the day to get uh, stuff on this channel. It's either my main channel or I'm shooting weddings right now in wedding season or I'm doing a bunch of other stuff. Anyway, that's it. Thanks I'm for late. watching. See you guys later.